END here. Wizard of the Coast, True Magic Esport have just released this Twitter. There will be no BNR banned and restricted changes prior to Mythic Championship number 6. The next BNR announcement will be November 18, 2019. This particular Twitter is very important because Oko, Thief of Crowns, will not get an emergency ban. Oko, Thief of Crowns is that particular Prince Walker that currently everyone is talking about. Everyone wants this Prince Walker. Everyone is hating this Prince Walker. Everyone is crying for a ban for this Prince Walker. This means that Oko, Thief of Crowns, will not get an emergency ban and until until november 18th this particular creature this particular planeswalker will continue to be played and dominate standards yes oko thief of crowns is a very very powerful planeswalker currently dominating standard i have done some videos regarding how oko is important for or how Oko is dominating standard, we are seeing tournament after tournament in standard where top 8, top 1, top 2 finishers all are playing places of Oko. Oko is dominating standard and no one has any doubt about it. Even championship number, mythic championship number 6, I'm sure that championship will be also dominated by Oko. Mythic Championship number 5 was won by Javier Dominguez. He had a very interesting deck. He had a Gruul Agro with Ember Cleaver as it's his finisher. He played against Field of the Dead. Now that Field of the Dead has been banned, all Cotif of Crowns have taken the show and he's dominating, outperforming every deck in standard. There is nearly 55 to 60% of the meta game in standard that has a playset of Oko Thief of Crowns. Oko Thief of Crowns, as I said, will remain in standard at least, at least by November 18th. On November 18th, there will be a BNR announcement and I think this particular BNR, BNR announcement will get a lot of people on the verge of X my of excitement, they they will be curious if Oko Thief of Crowns will be banned, or or another card from those particular decks will be banned. And I'm talking to the situation that happened for Hogak. When Hogak was dominating Modern Wizard of the Coast, instead of obviously banning Hogak. Hogak was a very important creature at that time for Modern Horizons. Wizard of the Coast wanted to sell Modern Horizons, therefore they couldn't just ban Modern Hori Hogak from Modern Horizons, from Modern, and they kept Hogak and they banned instead Bridge from Below. After one month, Hogak continued to dominate Modern, and finally Hogak was banned. Let's see if the same situation will happen for Oko Thief of Crowns. If the, the Planeswalker will continue to dominate standard, I'm sure that on November 18 we'll see some bans. But what cards will be banned? Will Oko be banned? Or will other cards in that particular deck, for example like Fable Passage, Once Upon a Time, or Questing Beast, Will one of these cards get the ban instead of Oko, or will Oko get the ban? Let's see and wait for November 18th and for Mythic Championship number 6 to confirm what will happen in Standard. You can leave me a comment below what do you think about the situation in Standard with Oko dominating. And here there's a subscription button, subscribe for my channel for more interesting videos about Magic the Gathering and the Collectible World.